my dears and welcome back to my corner of the internet. I am Shannon and today I've got another tea talk video to share with you guys. I've got my mug. I love this mug. A friend of mine brought this back um, over the summer last summer when they went home to visit their home province out east. I think it was Cape Breton and uh, I love it. It's one of those thick ceramic mugs that kind of look and feel like they're homemade. I just love it so much and it holds just the right amount of tea or coffee. And the tea that I have today is my Tetley immune tea. It's got lemon, echinacea, and zinc. It's so good. It tastes so good, but it's also good if you're feeling a little under the weather, which I have been, which is why there was no video on Monday, because <laughs> over the weekend I was too sick to even think about getting a video together. I had a really bad cold, but it's starting to lift. I feel like I've come back to the land of the living. Um, as of last night, I started to come around, and then today I even felt well enough to go um, to my sister's town to meet up with her for lunch. So that was nice that I got to see her. I always love to see her. And yeah, so I'm a little worried this tea is too hot. Sip yet, but you know what? We'll take it. We'll take it. Cheers. <laughs> my sister her and I and our children are gonna be doing some traveling towards the end of this month and I can't wait I'll share more details about that with you guys um, once we get closer to the time and I'm sure there'll be tons of vlogs once I get back I'm gonna pre film some videos so that while I'm gone I don't have to worry about it cause I'm not gonna be bringing my computer or my camera that I use for filming on a everyday basis so I'm just gonna be vlogging with my iPhone, so that should be interesting. Uh, but it'll be beautiful and sunny where I'm going, so I'm sure that will work just fine. And yeah, very excited for that. It's funny, before I came to sit down and film this video, I was writing down some notes of some tea topics that we could talk about in this video. And I was thinking like, oh, there's not really any YouTube drama happening. And then as soon as I said that, I turned on the TV to YouTube and Jeffree Star had uploaded a video about how over two million dollars of product was stolen from his warehouse um, a couple of weeks ago. And what I'm sure is really upsetting for him especially is that most of the products that were stolen uh, were brand new products that hadn't even been announced yet. There were concealers was the big one. Um, because face products is something he's going to be moving more into this year and he hadn't even gotten a chance to announce it yet and just from what he was saying thousands and thousands of units were stolen and that is that's a shame but from what he's been saying um, they've been able he's been working with the FBI and they've really been tracking and one of the people who was involved has already been arrested and they're working now to find more people who were, who were involved. And what's really sad too is he mentioned that he thinks it might have been an inside job from somebody who worked with his company at some point who gave maybe um, tips on how to get into the thieves. So that's, that's a shame. And in his video too he mentioned, and I remember um, from just watching YouTube about a year and a half ago, um, something similar happened to Anastasia. Uh, Beverly Hills, like four million dollars worth of pallets got stolen. Can't imagine. That's just, it's just awful. So that's the bit of YouTube drama that was happening today. Hmm. final thing that I wanted to do today in this video is I wanted to give a shout out to some smaller channels. It's been a while since I've done a straight up shout out video and I wanted to shout out channels that I don't think I've mentioned before and if I have it's been a while so that you can maybe find some new channels to love <laughs> and uh, they're just they're really great ladies. 
And if you love beauty content on YouTube, I think you'd really like them. So let me get my notes here. I wrote everyone's name down. So the first channel is called Kezi's Corner. And this woman is so sweet. She's First of all, she's so beautiful. And she's got such a sweet and uplifting personality. And um, she does a lot of beauty related videos um, where she does really beautiful looks and she'll do first impressions of products. And she also vlogs. She does a weekly vlog and it's just so fun to see her day to day life because she lives, I'm not entirely sure which country she lives in, but it's, it's far away from here. I'm thinking somewhere in Europe. I'm sorry that I don't know where you live, um, but it looks like a beautiful country. And um, I just, I really love watching her videos. She's got a great personality and she just lights up the room. So I would definitely recommend checking her channel out. And of course, I'm gonna link all of these channels down below so that you can easily find them. I'm, I don't, I don't know, a couple of weeks ago, I did a tag video. Not only did I not tag Tracy's video in the description box, I didn't even put the questions for the tag. And I didn't even notice until um, Lily Beth, she mentioned like, um, could you put the question? So I was like, ah, oh, of course. It's been one of those weeks, you know? The second channel that I want to shout out is Elizabeth's Life and Style. This woman is so special. She, again, has a lot of varied content on her channel. Now hers isn't so much makeup focused. It's more focused on other things. Um, but I think you will absolutely love her. She has a light about her that I don't even know how to describe it. She's just a very special woman. If you've seen and enjoyed the crystal related content on my channel, definitely go and check her out because she does a lot of things as well with tarot cards and crystals and, and just a lot of content relating to spirituality. And if you think you would like that, go and check it out. She also has the cutest little dog named Benji. And you just, you gotta see, you gotta see the whole thing, the whole situation that's going on over there. I think you'll love it. The next channel I have to tell you about is Beauty with a Heart. And there has never been a more aptly named channel. This woman is one of the sweetest most soft-spoken, most gentle people I've come across on YouTube. There's something so relaxing. Even the music that she plays in her videos, the images she uses, it's all so calming and relaxing. And she does pretty much all beauty-related content. She does a lot of stuff about ColourPop. She does beautiful looks, hauls, just all kinds of things beauty-related. And if you like a channel that is nice and calming, you'll absolutely love her. She seems like an absolute darling and you need to check her out. And the fourth and final channel that I wanted to shout out today is my friend Denise from the channel AbFab. Now, Denise, first of all, I get excited because Denise lives in my province. <laughs> and when I'm watching YouTube and I'm meeting friends, everyone seems so far away, but Denise, just lives a couple hours away and there's just something fun about that it makes it seem like she's she's a local friend <laughs> um anyway denise she makes lovely content she's she does again mostly beauty related content if not entirely beauty related content um she does hauls and makeup looks and reviews and she's just she's got a great personality she's absolutely beautiful and um again i think if you love beauty related content you would love Denise. So those are for now my four shout outs. I'm going to try to keep doing like once a month these tea talk videos have them mostly be shout outs for smaller creators because it's just it's just fun to share the love and spread the love and tell your friends about your other friends you know what I mean and uh, so yeah those four you can't go wrong with them you'll you'll absolutely love them. So Cheers to new friends.
that's gonna do it for me for now. I think I'm gonna take some night and go back to bed. But um, I hope you enjoyed this kind of quick little chat video. This Friday, we will be talking about The Great Alone by Kristen Hanna, finally. Um, and I can't wait. It's been quite the journey getting through this book, only because I haven't been feeling well. That's the only reason. It's not a difficult book to read. It's fantastic. And I've got some really exciting um, book talks coming up in the weeks ahead as well. Um, I just got a shipment from Amazon of some new of some new books. Can't wait to share them with you. All right, you guys, I will see you on Friday. I hope you have a great day. Bye.